Autism Resources of Utah County is a unique council of organizations and agencies collaborating in a non-competitive way to create integrated systems of support and treatment for individuals with autism and their families in Utah County. Autism Resources of Utah County Council, or AROC, was established in 2011 by like-minded folks who were more interested in supporting individuals and families with autism spectrum disorders than in profiting from their specific autism services. Initially, the goal was to get more familiar with all the organizations in Utah County that were currently assisting families living with ASD to avoid unnecessary duplication of services, and to determine what services were still missing in Utah County. The mission of AROC is to work together to form a collaborative support network for our friends in the autism community. We recognize that on our own, we can help, but together we can do more. We share our contributions regularly throughout the year. We may be best known for our community-sponsored events, such as the Uplifting Celebration for Autism, the annual Autism Hero Award, the Autism Friendly Family Carnival, the training symposiums, and parent dinners. However, some of the most important work AROC does is behind the scenes, giving support to items such as the continued growth of gold standard treatment services in Utah County, access to quality diagnostic services, the emotional needs of families and individuals with ASD, to improve community awareness and the preparation of educators and community workers to serve individuals with ASD and their families more effectively. AROC continues the mission and vision of those that began this in 2011. Together, we truly can do more. Each year, the Autism Resources of Utah County Council presents two awards to worthy applicants. The first, the Michael Sproul Community Spirit Award, recognizes a wide range of individuals or groups that are making contributions to the autism community in Utah Valley through time, resources, or advocacy. In 2020, we were fortunate enough to have four deserving individuals or organizations. The first was John Baird and the Rocky Mountain University Physician's Assistant Program. Among several reasons this organization deserved a Community Spirit Award was their collaborative effort to provide a field trip experience for children with autism to get practice with having medical exams while also providing training to help their students better care for individuals with autism and other disabilities when they get into their own practice. We applaud John Baird and the Rocky Mountain University Physician's Assistant Program for helping to shape the next generation of medical service providers. Tricia Nelson was nominated and selected for the exceptional program she has created at Utah Autism Academy. One of the events presented through the Academy was teaming up with Vivint Gives Back to take parents, staff, and individuals with autism to Disneyland, an experience that they wouldn't have had without the help provided. UAA also continues to use innovative approaches for working with children and their parents. Congratulations, Tricia. We are very pleased to select Tyler Evans, a 15-year-old student at Spectrum Academy in Pleasant Grove. Tyler is a great example of how someone with a disability can be comfortable and happy in their own skin. Tyler said, I want to help people understand how special needs works. People judge people with autism because of their behavior before they even know they have autism. Tyler continues that his goal is to be a good example of how you can be happy in life with a disability. Congratulations, Tyler. The fourth and final Michael Sproul Community Service Award, and most timely, was presented to Orem City Police Department. Under the direction of Chief Gary Giles and implementation of Sergeant Jeremy Jamison, Orem City was ahead of their time in providing training for officers to improve their understanding of individuals with developmental disabilities and mental health issues. They have also created a registry for people with autism in Orem, and they continue to plan a variety of events such as trunk or treat, Easter egg hunts, and participation in the annual Uplifting Celebration for Autism. 
Although Chief Giles retired last summer, we know that Orem City will continue to work diligently to improve these relationships. The second award is the Autism Hero Award, which recognizes an outstanding individual or group serving in Utah County that demonstrates ongoing passion and commitment to helping the autism community. The recipient must have worked in the field for 10 years or more and has had a deep impact and made lasting improvements for people on the spectrum and their families. Jared Stewart, one of Scenic View Academy's program directors, received the AREC Hero for Autism Award in 2020. Jared has worked with and trained multiple organizations to increase understanding of autism and does so with a personal perspective, living on the autism spectrum himself. His work in the field of autism over the past years has directly affected hundreds of lives and indirectly touched thousands. Jared believes all aspects of autism research, treatment, and services are essential at every age, but his passion is working with adults with autism and a desire to instill hope in those that experience autism. Congratulations to Jared Stewart. Our next recipient is Laurie Bowen. Laurie is the Associate Director of Community Outreach at the Melissa Nelson Center for Autism at Utah Valley University. Laurie was recognized for the work she has done in helping to bring the Autism Studies Program to UVU. She has also coordinated the Passages Program for college-age students at UVU with autism and also for the work she has done each year to continue to improve the UVU Autism Conferences. Congratulations, Laurie. 